This is APC Secretariat, situated on Ahmed Road, Ikeja, Lagos State, condoned off with officers of the Rapid Response Squad RRS of the Nigerian Police, stationed to keep the peace in and around the vicinity. Nothing visibly serious was taking place except for contestants going in and out of the Secretariat to submit their petition. Captain Television News spoke with some of the contestants who were still in high spirit and believe it's not over until it's over. What day there is nothing like election, it would be there is nothing like election. In what see also there is nothing like election, but in what day there is election, which I won my polling uh, unit for the primary election. But as a matter of fact, on that particular day, the name of uh, a new person was attached to the contest, which is a big surprise to me. And I believe the party I belong to is, a, is, a, is the best party in the nation, which they always follow the protocol and the procedure of the constitution. They would never do something that is, that is not acceptable. But one song that has continued to echo on the leaves of both contestants and supporters is that elections was never held following the disruption and subsequent cutting away of ballot boxes by thugs of unpopular candidates. You know, even before while we were waiting, the um, incumbent chairman came with some people and they went inside. So they couldn't even allow us to enter. But after some time, the people, you know, we were agitating, we've been waiting, so they had to push the gate to enter to see what was actually going on in that world. And um, when some people entered, because I couldn't enter that time because they were pushing and all of that. And by the time they entered, they couldn't even cast their votes. Before we could say Jack Robinson, we saw some men came, the thugs with cutlasses, some we came with uh, chants, different ones, body, everything. They were just disrupting the whole thing. At Ojokoro LCDA, rumor had it that one of the candidates, also known as Carigo, disrupted the exercise, an allegation refuted by these eyewitnesses. I think that one is a blat blatant lie. I was there live and uh, for, from what happened, I don't know whether they want to redefine what democracy is. If you look at what happened there, so many people were there and the crowd was really mammoth and they were supporters of uh, Karigo. And then suddenly when this opposing camp came, they saw that the crowd was intimidating. And what they did was that the only way to frustrate his effort was to cause commotion there. Eventually, they took the voting materials who were there, we stayed till four o'clock, thinking that they would come back. The um, incumbent chairman came with some of his people and some thugs and all of that. They came and they started causing commotions. We were like, what is happening? We've not even started voting and all these things are already happening. But they didn't even, they just, they just went inside, they pushed the gate in. People were shouting, what is going on? What are they doing there? They didn't even allow any one of us to enter again. And there was lots of noise. Before we could say Jack Robinson, they carried the, the incumbent chairman carried with some of his thugs that came with chance, but the different things, you know, all of that. When we saw it, it really scared us. We had to run. We, you know, we moved apart. So when he came like that, they carried the ballot box and with the incumbent chair man was there. Even the DP of Alakuko police station can bear me witness. She was there. So she was even shouting, don't carry this thing into the police station. No, no because the place we voted was close to Alakuko police station. For these card carry members of the APC, the idea of imposition or handpicking of candidates must be jettisoned and they are calling on the leaders of the party to let the popular candidate and the wish of the people prevail. My advice to APC is that they should go for the popular candidates if they are interested in the future. That is what I want to say. They should be interested in the popular, the man that commands the grassroots. Imposition is not the way out. If it's imposition, I want to believe that in Nambu, uh, Regbe, or so called, uh, what's it called, Fashola, or the, the, the current governor will have picked the guy. So if, if they believe that, let us test, test the candidates on ground. I don't think imposition is the matter. They, they knew quite sure that they cannot impose anybody on them. You make an attempt to impose people, then you are creating problems. So the best thing they can do is to allow people. 
to satisfy their conscience. I may, you may be my friend and I may not like you to be in government. You may be my enemy and I feel so I perform very better. They should be allowed to go in there. The last certainly may not have been heard concerning the turnout of events at the last Saturday's APC Lagos State primary elections. But it remains to be seen how it will all end. From Lagos, Love Uluwafemi Oyedukun, reporting for Captain Television News.